Hey, what's up, guys? This is Passchendaele. This is the final map of the DLC, Apocalypse, for Battlefield 1. I'm playing this on the Xbox One X on the Sony 900E. These maps are gorgeous. They are very immersive. Right now it's raining and the sound effects are incredible. But like I said in the last few videos, the maps are very dark. A little hard to see with all these weather effects and everything. As much as I love the immersion, it's just, you know, this is a multiplayer game after all. You'd like to be able to see what's going on. Not raining in this map when I started it. Our side is in the lead. Where'd that guy go? Oh, there he is. Oh, got a lot of buddies. Here. Halfway there. That was terrible. We need to push but harder. Cool maps. Great use of HDR, as you can tell by the lighting and the color. Just kind of drained out of this map, but as it brightens up, it gets into those. The skybox gets very. It's that peach orange tone. Right now, it has a very black and white look to it. Playing Team Deathmatch is why you're seeing me get shot from all over the place. The sound is excellent in this game. Again, in the comments, guys, were you happy with the return to World War One, World War Two? Side is in the lead. The settings, besides the boots on the ground aspect, just the settings in general. Help you jump and fire. What do you guys think about it? Are you guys happy that the the gameplay has gone back to? Like again, not just the boots on the ground, but to these older weapons and settings. For me, I was a huge fan of Battlefield 4. I enjoyed Modern Warfare. Games like that. I grew up playing all these World War II shooters. been playing them forever. So, get a little tired of them. But definitely enjoying the game. How it looks. Alright guys, thank you as always, that's the final map, more videos come.